It's a big night for Conan and St. Thomas, the 2019 semifinals for Division III boys basketball. You can do that. And while the fans are in place and the players are warmed up, a third team is also getting ready. A team that's become well known in high school athletics. St. Thomas taking on Conan. These two played earlier in the season. I don't think it These guys are part of nhsportspage.com, an internet portal where high school highlights are king. Haynes drives, floater, yes. They hand it off to Battle. Battle gets it to the end zone. Lesbrun's deep three. Drills it! It's sort of like their sports center moment, you know, their time to really get focused and spotlighted across the whole state. Complete. David's brought uh, New Hampshire high school basketball into everybody's living room. Back in 2008, Dave Haley started a little website called nhsportspage.com. We wanted to go really deep with it, introduce scoring leaders and real statistics and real analysis. He started showing up to games and would post written recaps and stats to the site. And eventually, it caught on. I think that first year we did New Hampshire Sports Days, I was probably lucky if 100 or 200 people were regular readers every week. And last week we had 9,000 people on the website. Exeter led for one minute tonight. It was the only minute that mattered! Kavanaugh up top, puts it on the floor, stops the right in block, puts it up the right hand, up and in. Over the first decade, the content grew. Video highlights were added, play-by-play, -play, and more people to cover more games. People who know these teams inside and out. And again, they're going to try to find those guys in the corner. Dave himself, as a kid, played in a championship basketball game with Guilford. Did, did you win the championship game? Thank you for bringing that out. <laughs> We lost by four points to Mass. Come on, we need calls. Rebound goes to the Orioles. St. Thomas should out-rebound Conan tonight. Dave is calling the games these days, often joined by radio man Justin McIsaac. He, too, is a former athlete in wrestling. Yeah, I wrestled as uh, Justin Shape and uh, also as the alpha male, Justin Powers. Yep, that's Justin. He spent 11 years as a pro wrestler in tights. And in this war, I am a weapon of mass instruction. Nine points already, 14-6 all of a sudden. Fact is, while they take the coverage seriously, they don't take themselves too seriously. Here we go, here we go. They're characters, often blurring the lines on who's having more fun. They are the Campbell High Cougars, the Division Three state champions. Oh, boy. NH Sports Page covers football in the fall and boys and girls basketball in winter. And the half dozen staff members do all of this in their spare time. It's Pinkerton and it's Londonderry and Mac Plack weekend. Guys like Pete Tarrier. By day, he works in radio sales, but he'll drive hours each week to get to all corners of the state. We take more pride in going up to Claremont and covering a Stevens game or driving out to Monadnock, uh, out to Swansea and seeing small school football. Here's how it works. The crew shows up to a game. They do a taped preview and then play-by-play play from start to finish. In other words, Conan's going to give over, give away that reverse pass. Once the game ends, the winning team gathers for their favorite part, post-game celebrations and interviews. Do you relish the opportunity to catch some passes, too? Yeah, definitely. Uh, took Gujar a little while to heat up tonight. Three, two, one, yeah! They're all plugged into what he's doing, and they all want the spotlight. Um, he's got them like the Pied Piper. We are defeated! We are defeated! When all is said and done, it's boiled down into a short highlight reel and posted for people to view on the website. And people are watching. I've had more people in the five, ten years I've been doing this notice me than my entire 30-year radio career. So, you know, we must be doing something right. You guys ready to roll? Oh, always. Dave 
Dave and his team say building relationships with players and coaches are key to creating good reports. And they take pride in documenting moments for these young athletes. One of Dave's favorites, Littleton versus Groveton, and the voice crack heard round the world. And he hit a three-pointer in the last 30 seconds of the game. My voice actually cracked like I was 11 years old. Lesbrin's deep three, drills it! Drills it with 10 seconds to go! Time out! Groveton is the state champion! Mark Collins wins his seventh! Along with sacrificing their vocal cords, the NH Sports Page staff makes those sports memories even more colorful and unforgettable. Case in point, the parking lot shot from St. Thomas. This kid Ian Wilson wasn't a superstar basketball player or anything. He hit a three-point shot from the volleyball line. Wilson shoots it from the parking lot! Years after that moment, Justin was at a rest stop in Maine. This guy comes up to me and goes, hey, are you Justin McIsaac? I'm like, yeah. He's like, it's me, Ian Wilson, you know, from the parking lot. And it was, it was, it was just such a cool moment because he's going to remember that the rest of his life. Cross, but he didn't have the football. There goes the left Nine seconds to go. Littleton down two. If we can make it special for them and play a very small role in making it better, then that's what we do. That's what keeps me coming out on Friday nights and, and on Tuesday nights, and I want to give up my time to go do this stuff because I, I know I'm making a, a difference in somebody's life, and that feels pretty good.